पैसेज सेवन क्लॉज टू डिफाइंस द एक्सप्रेशन वेरी प्रेस्टिजियस यूनिट एज अ न्यू इंडस्ट्रियल यूनिट इस्टैब्लिश्ड इन एनी पंचायत समिति ऑफ द स्टेट ड्यूरिंग द पीरियड ऑफ दिस स्कीम इन विच इन्वेस्टमेंट इन फिक्स्ड कैपिटल इज रुपीज हंड्रेड करोर्स और मोर हाउ एवर द प्रोग्रेसिव इन्वेस्टमेंट ऑफ द अमाउंट ऑफ प्रोजेक्ट कॉस्ट एज एप्रेज बाय द फाइनेंशियल इंस्टीट्यूशंस शैल बी कंसिडर्ड एज इन्वेस्टमेंट मेड बाय अ न्यू यूनिट एंड एज सुन एज सच इन्वेस्टमेंट रीचेस और क्रॉसेस द पॉइंट ऑफ रुपीज हंड्रेड करोर्स ड्यूरिंग द ऑपरेटिव पीरियड ऑफ द स्कीम the unit shall acquire the status of a very prestigious unit for the purpose of claiming enhanced proportionate benefits under this scheme para the very prestigious unit means a new industrial unit established in any panchayat samiti in the state during the operative period of the scheme and the other important requirement is the investment in such industrial unit must be rupees 100 crores or more <coughs> the second limb of the definition clause provides for a new industrial unit to acquire the status of very prestigious unit the project cost as appraised by the financial institution shall be considered as investment made by a new unit the progressive investment of the amount of project cost as soon as it reaches or crosses the point of rupees 100 crores during the operation of the scheme the industrial unit shall acquire the status of a very prestigious unit in order to claim enhanced proportionate benefits under the scheme clause 2 provides for constitution of screening committee for the purpose of consideration and to grant eligibility certificate under the new incentive scheme both for small and medium and also large scale industrial units to avail benefit under the new incentive scheme the note appended to this sub clause speaks of small scale units medium scale units and large scale units small scale units means a unit of which investment in plant and machinery does not exceed rupees 60 lakhs a medium scale unit means a unit of which the project cost does not exceed rupees 5 crores and large scale unit means a unit of which the project cost exceeds rupees 5 crores clause 3 of the notification speaks of applicability of the scheme by this clause the state government has made the scheme applicable to one new industrial units to industrial units going in for expansion or diversification and three six units clause 4 provides for exemption from payment of sales tax para as we have observed earlier an exer c has five columns the second column speaks to speaks of type of units the third column speaks of the extent of percentage of exemption from tax the fourth column provides for the maximum exemption in terms of percentage of fci and the fifth and the last column provides the maximum time limit for availing exemption from tax prior to issuance of notification an exer c was primarily confined to new units after the introduction of notification the exclusion is made to the expression new units by specifically including certain type of industrial units by inserting 
आइटम्स वन ए टू वन एफ आइटम वन ई स्पेसिफिकली टॉक्स ऑफ न्यू सीमेंट यूनिट्स एक्सेप्ट इन ट्राइबल सब प्लान एरिया द एक्सटेंट ऑफ परसेंटेज ऑफ एग्जम्शन फ्रॉम टैक्स अंडर आइटम वन ई डिपेंड्स ऑन द टाइप ऑफ यूनिट और द इंडस्ट्री प्यारा इफ इट इज अ स्मॉल स्केल यूनिट द एक्सटेंट ऑफ एग्जम्शन इज सेवेंटी If it is a medium scale the extent of exemption is 50% and if it is large scale unit the extent of percentage of exemption from tax is 25% the maximum time limit for availing exemption from tax is restricted to 7 years item 4 speaks of new units producing pollution control equipments pioneering units and prestigious units the extent of the percentage of exemption from tax is 75% of total liability and the maximum time limit for availing exemption from tax is 9 years from the date of commercial production item 5 relates to new very prestigious units other than cement units except in tribal sub plan area and the total percentage of exemption from tax is 90% of total tax liability and the maximum time limit for availing exemption from tax is 11 years reverting to state the facts the respondent sac had applied to the state level screening committee for claiming benefit of exemption of 75% under the scheme the committee rejected the claim of the respondent sac and observed that since the respondent sac is a large scale unit covered under the specific provision of item 1e of annexer c it is entitled to 25% exemption by its order being aggrieved by the said order the respondent sac filed appeal before rajasthan tax board ajmer in respect of calculation of eligible fci as well as the exemption under the scheme the board while remanding the matter to the state level screening committee held that the respondent sac is entitled to 75% tax exemption by holding the respondent unit as prestigious unit under the scheme under the rule framed